Hmm. Okay. Hello. Oh my god, all of this just to get to the other side. Is it actually showing me the way I'm supposed to go? Actually, I'm not, I'm not gonna risk it. I'm gonna take this way. I know where this is going. Oh, I made it. Fudge, fudge. And my game. Oh, okay, oh. Hello? Only one way out, only one way. <coughs> okay. How do you know you're not a patient? I just know, okay? I just... Where did you go? And why did why did you close the door on me? You know what? Whatever. Why is my game freaking out? Something's gonna happen. Like uh, a huge thing's gonna. Don't do that. Just don't. Don't go all slender on me. Don't. I've been playing for 20 minutes now. Oh, not you. Not you, motherfucker. What's here? <coughs> Why are you here? And where? Where is he gonna go? He's actually gonna come here. Okay. He is. I'm just going this way then. Okay, never mind. No. I'm not here, I'm not here, I'm not here, I'm not here. Of course he. Of course he finds me. Oh, and he misses me completely. Okay, that's kind of good. Where, where am I supposed to go? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I... No, get away from me. Oh, oh, I actually, I actually made it. Stop! You're not nice. Jump! 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 Hi! <coughs> oh, that's creepy. Why is your head like sideways? What's here? Fine, reload your battery. I'm. Okay, that was a little close there. I'm sure we. Just read it quickly. I know there's the same conversation with the villain this morning. The same Dr. Winnicky again in front of therapy with his blood play. Um, it's a bright fact that his delusions are in the kind of worse with medication. He's in the literature for benzo DIs in a penny. Whatever. In any case, he's had already filling his head with more German folklore. Apparently, you know, the thing that can kill the world right or vampiric butterflies vomited from a demon called Horrorxy. <coughs> the butterflies suck the breath from people's lips and drink blood from their nipples. Okay. Not my nipples. Please, not my nipples. They can also take the form of MSCP. M Emaciated upright pigs or sick dogs, so Billy's got that going for him. You mentioned Billy taking whatever. I'm done. Let's get out of here quickly before the fat guy appears. <coughs> I'm afraid of fat people. Stop going slender. It's it's almost 10 p.m. 
And I'm playing in a, war, in a horror game. Hello? Okay. I don't like you. Hello? Is it, is it this? <coughs> is it this the way I came? It is. This is the beginning. Confidation. You can read that. Um, sorry. Bidib. Bidib. I just read. Oh, hi. Mary! I just read signature ill something. Bidoo! Open. Hi. game if a door is closed you cannot go in it just you just can't why am I hearing piano music all of a sudden don't do it am I supposed to go down no then oh hey I'm down hey Hello? I'm really sorry for the coughing. Or coughing. Whatever. The game is running pretty smoothly, actually. I'm kinda surprised. It would usually lag a little. But it's not. I mean, my PC isn't shit. That much of a shit. Uh, yep. Uh, yep. I'm scared. Hello. Oh no, that's not cool. Where are you going? Did he just vanish? I think he did. I think he just vanished. Hello. Huh. Oh my! Uh, exit interview. Movie time. December twenty-seventh, nineteen eighty-five, Los Alamos, New Mexico. <coughs> Clearance Sierra Alpha, subject Dr. Rudolf Wernicke, 14866. The films are real. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all, no trickery? None. In June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believed. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, and English words are insufficient. <laughs> More than hope. A human mind in that environment is capable 
of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed... The proximity to death. To overwhelming madness. Only a test <coughs> subject who had witnessed the horror was capable of activating the engine. Do you believe your test subjects achieved something supernatural? No. Do you think that they contacted something supernatural? Nothing is supernatural. Then what was it? You said Project Wallrider was a gateway. A gateway to what? Is it over? Okay, so I had a note. The man sounds like Dr. Strangelove's anemic brother. It's a 25 year old radio recording and interview with this Dr. Wernicke. Los Alamos uh, means government work. Wernicke talks about spontaneous bleeding, tumors, psychosomatic reactions, and sufficiently disturbed people. Seems to walk a line between science and Nazi mysticism. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the, the engine, the morphogenic, <coughs> the morphogenic engine. The engine, the movie they're projecting. It's getting in my head like a song you can't stop humming. I blink and see Rorschach, Rorschach, whatever, tests that look like swarming insects and infected surgery wounds. The patients talk about using the engine to conjure the wall rider. It's the buzzing I hear in my bones. Okay. Whatever. Hi. Okay? I will, buddy. After I nail your mama. Ah, I'm sorry. Aha. Hello there. Uh, <coughs> Wash those hands regularly. Flesh eating bacteria. Necrotizing fasciitis? Really? I fucking quit. I'm no expert in biology or stuff from that region or area, but I'm pretty sure that's bad. I'm pretty sure that's a bad thing. Oh, I see something shining. Let's get it first, before moving on, it's a battery. Oh my god, dude! I... I... <coughs> How are you there? You are not there. Oh my lordy lord, Lou. Hey! You didn't close the door. Well, whatever. That works for me. <coughs> I just have to go on my way to that. Um, thingy. Yeah. That I can't remember the name of this little thingy. Uh, okay. Aha! Motherfucker! Motherfucker! Where, where to now? I just leave. Did he?